po i orat. Egli o vokto en regibliot volantico, drivo perzu, silvio onio, to heriro elio exio onio sit. Va mirien je jorin, that's about the extent of my valerian, Thank you for traveling all this way. I know from personal experience how uncomfortable the journey can be. The truth is, we need your help. We'd hope that we could somehow persuade you to... You don't need to persuade me. I came to help. Daenerys Storborn is the one who was promised. From the fire, she was reborn to remake the world. Yes. She has freed the slaves from their chains and crucified the masters for their sins. She did, indeed. Her dragons are fire made flesh. A gift from the Lord of Light. But you heard all of this before, haven't you? On the long bridge of Volantis. The dragons will purify non-believers by the thousands, burning their sins and flesh away. Ideally, we'd avoid purifying too many non-believers. The Mother of Dragons has followers of many different faiths. You want your queen to be worshipped and obeyed. And while she's gone, you want her advisors to be worshipped and obeyed. I'd settle for obeyed. I will summon my most eloquent priests. They will spread the word. Daenerys has been sent to lead the people against the darkness. In this war, and in the great war still to come. That sounds most a excellent. A man named Stannis Baratheon was anointed as the chosen one by one of your priestesses. He too had a glorious destiny. He attacked King's Landing and was soundly defeated by the man standing beside me. Last I'd heard, he'd been defeated again, this time at Winterfell, and this time for good. We'd be most grateful or any support you could provide the Queen. I suppose it's hard for a fanatic to admit a mistake. But isn't that the whole point of being a fanatic? You're always right. Everything is the Lord's will. Everything is the Lord's will. But men and women make mistakes. Even honest servants of the Lord. And you, an honest servant of the Lord? Why should I trust you to know any more than the priestess who counseled Stannis? My friend has a healthy skepticism of religion, but we are all loyal supporters of the Queen. Everyone is what they are and where they are for a reason. Terrible things happen for a reason. Take what happened to you, Lord Varys, when you were a child. If not for your mutilation at the hand of a second-rate sorcerer, you wouldn't be here, helping the Lord's Chosen bring his light into the world. Knowledge has made you powerful. But there's still so much you don't know. Do you remember what you heard that night, when the sorcerer tossed your parts in the fire? You heard a voice call out from the flames, do you remember? Should I tell you what the voice said? Should I tell you the name of the one who spoke? We serve the same queen. If you are her true friend, you have nothing to fear from me.